Hi everyone, I hope you're all having a wonderful day. I have a box here and it's from e.l.f. I did a little shopping haul. I don't know how to get into this box, honestly. Maybe just pull it down. I have no idea how to get into this. Like I'm ripping apart this box just to try to get in and I can't figure out a way in. <laughs> okay, let's take that off. How do you get in this box? I'm trying to get Okay, with a little bit of effort, I'm in. I don't know if I just, if everything's in here or not. So this is a little bit of what I have here. This box is tough to get in. Okay, I do have my phone because, so that I can kind of see what I ordered. I don't know if there's a receipt in here. I don't know. I don't see anything receipt wise. Oof. So let's see if I can do this with. Um, I have no idea of how I'm going to be able to how to do this honestly. To try to find things that I ordered. Okay, so the first thing that I ordered, <laughs> I can see that on my little receipt. Is the sheer slick I would assume this is a bomb sheer slick lipstick in black cherry and this was three dollars and fifty cents right here let's open some of these hey honestly it's been so long for me to to even try any of their stuff and I figured why not let's take it out So here is the color. Let's do a little swatch. Just a bomb, but it does put down some color. Pretty, I like that. Just wanted some like more like bomb types to do like every day. Sometimes I don't feel like putting lipstick on. I mean, I have it on today, but sometimes I have to go darker for camera where in real life I might just put a, have a bomb on or want to go slightly lighter, but that's really pretty. I like that. So let's put that back there. Um, let's see if I have, so that was 350. The next one, I did get a second one if I can find it. This box has, oh, see it. <laughs> All these little squigglies in there. Same thing, and this is jam or jelly. This is more of a pink, you know, same 350. I didn't think that was too bad for um, price-wise. Let's get you out. Here's the little tube. Cute. And this is what this looks like. That's a pink. I mean, I know it's not going to roll out like bright. Oh, and that's perfect. You can see that right there. I love it. You know, I love my... It's right behind me, and I do have a backup for it. Let me get this back in the box. I'll just put this here. I love my tart. And of course, can I read that? It's rose. Here it is. And I grab I have one in my handbag. I grab for this all the time. And I'll just put this on my hand to show you. This is super light, but when it's on your lip, I don't know if you can see it. It's over here. It puts just that little hint of color on your lip. And sometimes that's all I want, just a little thing. So I keep it out because I do gravitate to that a lot. Um, but I love that. Now, let's see if we can find, go to the next screenshot. I did save quite a few screenshots. So Black Cherry Jam and Joey. The next thing is a pencil. I did see you. Is this what it is? Instant Lift. Instant Lift Brow Pencil in Neutral Brown. This was $3.00. I'm not going to open this. This is sealed up. It has a spoolie, as you can see, and the product is up here. I figured I'd give it a try. Fair, fair price. And if I love it, <coughs> I am loving my hourglass pencil. They're kind of expensive, and I'd rather try to find a drugstore option that I could easily go and find in a store and stock up and only pay a couple dollars for them instead of $12, $14 for a pencil. Even though I love it, 
and I will repurchase but if I can try to find one that I love then that's fine too so that's that then I have I'm going to the next one um cookies let me see cookies and dreams single scoop sponge was five dollars I saw some really where are you some really good reviews on this sponge so I figured let me try it once again affordable and you know I'm not worried if I you know if you have to toss it after a little bit I mean you can clean them for a little bit but of course I can't get you out why okay this is weird come on oh it has a tone on the top it was so funny this is oh let me see if I can put it back on so in the package it looked like that and I was like a lot but there's this is what it looks like and this is nice and soft and squishy but I heard this is really great for what it is you know it's not the beauty blender for $20 but I also refuse to spend $20 on a beauty blender now if I'm gifted a beauty blender all day long but I'm not paying that price so I'm excited to try that and for five dollars since it appeared to be good i'm happy with that um putty primer trio for me was free i think for purchasing so here it is the poreless putty primer matte putty primer and the luminous putty primer i've been wanting to try these um for a long time um just to see what i think how can i get these out and I figured, you know what, now's the time. So they're tiny little pots. One, two, three. So this one, oh, I cannot see what it, this is the coreless one right here. I've heard wonderful things about their primers. The luminous is right here. Get these open. But I love that this was a free gift. To tr if I love them, if there's one that I love more than the others, and this is the matte primer, that I'm excited I would get the full size. I mean, I might have got the full size in the one. So that was really cute to get the, it's a little free trio of the primers. And I figured, you know what? Perfect. If you're unsure of which one, let's just put them back in the box. However, and then I'll play with them. See, so if you're not sure, then that's a good way to try it out. And that was free let's see let's go to the next picture I gotta bring it back down next picture is um the putty primer okay let's go to this one come on um now that's the scene let's move up here come on um i think that was free too correct so this was also free and this is an eyeshadow palette where are you i don't see you in here let me see if i can find you what are these little boxes nope nope it's not that one is it this one okay let's see there's a little brown box yes i think this is the one this was also free and this is their mint melt eyeshadow palette and these i've heard were very good now, I'm not going to open this right now and do anything. I'm not so much of a green person, but I've, and I just had a palette from Lorella. Oh, this, there's a rogue hair from Lorella that was a lot of green. I am not keeping that because I know I won't touch it. But something like this that still has some browns and they're matte. It has, you know, some shimmers that I, maybe I could try a little green shimmer. Um, instead of like a full green look, I don't think I can do that. So I'm excited for this. And this was also a free gift. So, you know, I'm all about the free gifts. I'm trying to think if that's all that I bought. Um, no. No, let me see. I got some more stuff. The other item that was free as a free gift is the um, Mini Holy Hydration Makeup Melting Cleansing Balm. That was free. That should be this. Right? Holy Hydration. That's it. That's not... A small little sample this is 1.8 ounces i'm not upset with this i mean elf is drugstore but 
This is Kelly Strack's fault. You know, I keep on watching her videos and I, I'm loving the videos that she's putting out using a lot of elf products and you don't have to spend a lot of money. Yeah, it's nice to have the higher end bougie stuff, but it's not necessary. Mm, that looks nice and that's, you know, just a cream and it doesn't, let me try, there's a little bit in the lid. I'm just going to put some on my arm. See, that's not real heavy. Well, that's nice. I like that. Let me see. Um, no real scent. You know, just your typical, like slightly chemical-ish, but not. And this is for dry, oily, and combination skin. So, that, I mean, it's free. This was free. Am I going to complain about a free, like, moisturizer? No. And it, you know, absorbed right into my arm. So, I'm not, like I said, awesome. Um, I think... And then what I bought, which started the whole thing, is the Elf Mystery Bundle was $28. Now, everything is loose. It didn't show it this way in um, when you checked out. It looked like it was in a box. So I don't know why they did this, but whatever. So here, part of my mystery box from is the Poreless Putty Primer. And this is Universal Sheer. And that's a full size, obviously. It's not the... But I don't think, did I get this one? The Horless. I think that, that one was in the other one. So let's take this out. I can get it out. Horless. So this is what this looks like. Right here. Nice. I'm not putting my finger in anything right now. So this is what the package looks like. Cute. Part of the mystery bundle. So th then in this brown box, there was a little palette. Part of the bundle and this is the bite size face duo watermelon so that's really adorable like a blush and a highlighter you could use them for shadows whatever you would like so that's part of the mystery bundle what is this and here there's a lot of fuzz on everything from all these little squigglies all over the place here we have a lip lacquer in clear Look how they did the cute little top. It's like a little, a little handle. I'm sure that's how they hang them on the shelf, but a little lip lacquer, a little lip gloss. So that's good. What is this? Oh, we have a sponge, a total face sponge. Use wet or dry. I won't take that out in case I share it because I, how many sponges do I need? And then there's a couple more items in here. Oreo. Oreo. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, here's a little sample of the full size that I got. The Holy Hydration right here. Make, oh no, this is a, wait a second. Is this a cleansing balm? This is actually a face cream with hyaluronic acid and peptides. This, it's not. It's the same Holy Hydration. This is Makeup Melting Cleansing Balm. And this is sealed, so I'm going to leave it sealed. That's all part of the uh, mystery bundle. And it looks like the last item is a no budge shadow stick in perfect pearl. Love me. I don't know if I can pull this one off. I think I might have some like this. Let me see if I can get this open. I didn't think this was bad for a mystery box from Elf. I've never done a mystery box from Elf. I can get this box open without trashing it. Let's, how do you get these products out of these packages? Oh, well, this, so here's the packaging right here. Let's see what it looks like. Here is the shade. Let me see if I can get it on my arm. Well, that's pretty. So that is right down here. I don't know if you guys can see that. Pretty. I would definitely use that. That would be great for your inner corner for highlight and sometimes I like to go very front center eye lash line and put something brighter it just open it for me it just opens my eye right up so I'm not angry at that at all that's a nice little surprise so that was everything that was in the mystery box plus a few little things that I ordered I thought this was pretty good I mean this box was a little bit of a hassle to get open but you know, sometimes you have to work for some good stuff. I am pleased. I don't know if I have a total. Did I save something that told me a total of what I spent? Um, does this have the total on it? Let me see, because this is towards the bottom. No. Nope. 
I didn't save anything that has like the total, but I'll post a list of everything that I purchased with prices. If it was free, if it was included, what's part of the mystery bundle. So I kind of kept them separate. I think this is a brand that not enough talk about. I don't see a ton of videos on e.l.f. And uh, I'm excited to try, especially the primers. I'm always looking for a good primer, and I've seen such great reviews on e.l.f.'s primers. And these lip products, and it's just these two over here, are adorable. Adorable. And I love the, the lip, the shadow crown. And I, on a lazy day like today, I have zero eye makeup on uh, whatsoever. My eye is just very teary today because allergies are high for me. And I have that rogue hair that I'm going to pull out, I swear. Um, sometimes that's easy for me just to put, get a brown or something similar and do the, the crease in the corner and then hit it in the dead center with like a light shade and you're done. You don't have to fuss around and a lot of times you can blend it with your finger real fast and just smudge out any lines and blend a little. I usually use just a small brush, but I'm excited to try some of them lip products. I think they're phenomenal and most days that's what I like to have on my lips versus um, like a matte lipstick. It's They're very drying. And then, you know, every night anyway, when I do my skincare, I'm always using a lip scrub just to hydrate and make sure I have all this product off. But tell me what you thought of this little e.l.f. haul. I'm excited. And the e.l.f. mystery box or bundle, however you want to word that. And um, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Have a wonderful day, everyone. And I'll catch all of you in my next video. Bye-bye now.